I'm Kelly Klein. I live in the town of Oma. In reading through the proposed ordinance on metallic mining, my first thought is this would discourage mining and economic development in Iron County. I'm not saying the county should not have a zoning ordinance, but this ordinance should be revisited. One of the most striking provisions in the ordinance is the provision for a blank checkbook. I can't imagine any business, mining or otherwise, that would be willing to give unlimited funds to government. In fact, future businesses for Iron County may look at this and decide to go elsewhere. The second impression I had about the ordinance is it tends to do what state and federal agencies are already doing. I really question why Iron County needs to be in the business of regulating mining on environmental issues when the Department of Natural Resources is already doing this. Iron County doesn't have the expertise and businesses should not have to pay twice for duplicate regulations. That's overreaching and it results in excessive taxation. The third impression is the ordinance appears to be a moving target. Comments have been made that this ordinance would be a placeholder, then changes would be made as time goes on. I wouldn't think any business would want the rules changing as it creates uncertainty and it could create the loss of jobs. All of these things discourage economic development. Now that's the real impact of mining and I would ask you not to forget about the jobs, increased household income, increased property values, increased infrastructure, and the possibility of new business development. Again, I'm not arguing the county should not adopt an ordinance, but I'm asking that the county not put up any roadblocks to economic development. I would like the zoning committee to table the proposed ordinance and suggest that the committee work through your mining attorney with various departments and county government as well as businesses to develop a win-win ordinance for Iron County. Thank you.